Hey guys, welcome to Unit 5 Review. This is all about logarithms and knowing how to write back and forth. So before I start, I want you guys to know that um, how to rewrite them in exponent form. This is called your exponential. Okay? Exponential is always you have the base to the exponent is equal to y. So this is your base. This is your exponent, and this would be an answer, and I'm just going to write S-L-O-N, okay? So if you were to rewrite this as a logarithm, if this is just learning how to rewrite, you would write the word log. The base goes down here, the solution goes right here, and that's equal to x. All of this should be all in the same line, okay? So it's log. Base goes as a subscript, y goes back to the line, and so does your x. And a way you can think of this is the rotation you might use. Um, it really helps a lot. So look, b to the x is equal to y. Just like the base to your solution is equal to x. Okay? So think of that rotation. Now let's look at number one. It says, Rewrite each equation in exponential form. So the form I want is b to the x is equal to y. Figure out what your base is. Your base is 19, goes to the second. 19 squared is 361. So if you check that on your calculator, okay, 19 squared, you see how that's 361. Okay, so that's how that works. All right, number two. Your base is a 13, exponent is 2, is equal to 169. 13 squared is 169. On number 3, 17 squared is equal to 289. Okay. On number 4, it is 12 to the 0 is equal to 1. Anything to the 0 power is 1. Number five, your base is a 13, your exponent is a negative 2, that's equal to 1 over 169. So 13 to the negative 2 is equal to 1 over 69, okay? All right, I just want to point this out. This is the same as 1 over 13 squared, which is 1 over 169. These are the same. All right, number, 20, number six, your base is 216 to the third power is equal to 6. See how there's no log? You're going from log to exponent. Second part. Let's look at this part. It says you are going to rewrite in logarithmic form. Okay? Right now it is given to you as an exponent. B to the, B to the x is equal to y. So we're going to rewrite it as a log. So you write the word log base is 15. Of 225 is equal to 2. 15 squared is 225. So inverse of that would be log base 15 of 225 is equal to 2. Number 8. Log base of 12. Base 12 of 144 is equal to 2. Okay? Check the rotation. That might help you guys as well. Number nine. Log base of 19. Log base 19 of 1 over 361 is equal to negative 2. See that? Okay. Know your base. Know your exponent. Number 10. Log base 2 of 64 is equal to 6. Okay. Number 11. Log base 4 of 4 is equal to 1. See the rotation? Number 12. Log base 18 of 324 is equal to 2. Notice that there's a pattern. All this is all based on pattern. That's pretty much math. Okay. 
Number 13. All right, you are to expand your logarithm. Know that multiplication and addition goes together and division and subtraction goes together for the reason being, for example, if I have x squared times x to the fifth, the answer is x to the seventh, okay? Why? Because it's 2 plus 5, and that's how you get x to the seventh. You add your exponent, and that's where that property comes from. So if you look at number 13, <coughs> okay? I'm expanding. So basically, I'm adding log to every one of these. So log base 3 of u, what corresponds with multiplication? Addition. So I'm going from one log to a lot of logs. Log base 3 of v, see how I'm just really distributing the logs? Plus log base 3 of w to the fifth. Okay. Well, you've got to move the exponent to the front when you are expanding. All the others are 1, so you don't have to do that. So log base 3 of u plus log base 3 of v plus 5 times log base 3 of w. And there you have expanded. Number 14. All righty. On number 14, so I have log base 4 of u to the 6. This is multiplication, corresponds with adding. So log base 4 of v to the 6, okay? Move your exponent to the front because you are expanding. So I'm making it bigger, we're going from one log to two here. So the answer is 6 log base 4 of u plus 6 log base 4 of v. You could also write your answers like this. 6 parentheses, log base 4 of u plus log base 4 of v. Both of those are the same answer. I just factor out a 6. Make sure you recognize how things are written. And there you have your page 1.